Mm. For every department, for every work, in it is done by law. We have not followed the sixth schedule. Sixth schedule is a mini constitution. It is written in the in the first page. Sixth schedule to the constitution is a mini administration of tribal areas of northeastern part of our country. This is the Constitution of India. Constitution of India, India country has been built. It has been, India country has been constructed. And North Kachar Hills or Dimahasau is constructed with this mini constitution. Constitution is a legal framework for constructing a country. A country banana ke liye constitution hai. Uh, constitution jo kya hai ye? Shangvidhan. Shangvidhan to is not a reservation law. It is not reservation law. But because we have not followed law, the first CEM laid John Nao Hau Kotlan. He followed law in the beginning. And so he established customary law courts. One thing he did. Mm. But he has not, of course, he did not also know, so he did not make the land law of the Dimasas or Mar, Kuki, Jem, Jeme, Khasi or Karbi here. He did not know about constitution part, paragraph. <clears throat> first, the first thing that he has forgotten or did, maybe he did not know is the fundamental part of the six year. Fundamental uh, article, the uh, paragraph for establishing autonomous district. It is a fundamental thing. Without that, autonomous council cannot stand. There is no place to stand if that is not made. And that is paragraph 2 sub paragraph 7. We have not made. India, under the constitution of India, the first thing India government did was enacting uh, People's Representation Act in 1950 itself. We did not do that. We should have made our People's Representation, uh, Autonomous District People's Representation Act. We did not make this. Till now we have not made and so what is what is, what has happened? We lost our political power one by one. One by one. Our land, especially in Karbianglong, West Karbianglong, we have lost our land also. In Karbianglong, in 1951, as per census, Karbi people were 88% population. 88% were Karbis. Tribal, all tribal people combined together, 96% in 1951. Non-tribal people, only 4%. Only 4%. Now in, <coughs> in 2000, 
2011 census, Carby people percentage has come down to 44%. And tribal people total came down to 55%. Now, as per law of natural justice, if the name Carby Anglong is to be retained, Carby population must be minimum 51%. We are now 44%. That means what is the meaning? That means there is no Carby Anglong. See, we have lost our district. So in 2007, Indian Army they surveyed the whole of Karbi Anglong and Dimhasau and they published a booklet like this and distributed to the uh, journalists and reporters in a press conference saying Karbi Anglong is a lost district because the level of awareness of the people is extremely low extremely low not only low extremely there is no no more space left to be more ignorant this is the meaning so we have lost our country this dimasa cookie people here they are going to lose their country slowly but surely they will lose if we go on like this their non-tribal population has increased a lot, na? increased. They have come from outside. Our people is, have not died. We, our people have not run away. But the fact is that other people have come from outside so much so that we are marginalized. They always take less power. Shameful how we did it, and we used to be so happy that we used to burn crackers and eat a pork. This is the law of the Lord. This is all right, this is religious matter. Second thing, what did Ezra say? Ezra said he also made his mind to seek and learn the law of the country, statutes, and to teach the people of Israel. So now, what shall we do? Our land is being lost, destroyed. Because, why? Because we do not know the law of God. One side is his religious thing, but an uh, earthly thing, government, we are unable to know the law of the country. We do not know 